Okay guys, gonna go over a workout you can do at home if all you have access to is one barbell. Um, hopefully, along with that barbell, you have some plates so you can add some weight to it throughout the workout. Uh, the description of the workout will be uh, in the description of the video, just underneath here. Uh, it'll kind of lay out how it's all gonna work. Basically, it's 10 sets. You're gonna do five strict presses, seven front squats, nine hang muscle cleans, which is really just kind of like a cheating reverse curl with the bar, uh, and then 11 deadlifts. The idea is that you're gonna perform that entire complex unbroken without having to stop and put the bar down. Put it down after your last deadlift, rest as needed, really as little as possible, uh, and then uh, proceed with your next set. So it's 10 unbroken sets um, of that entire complex. You can start light and add weight as you go. The idea ultimately would be to try to build up to as much weight as you possibly can handle uh, and still go unbroken for the entire complex, really for as many sets as possible. So there's a whole bunch of different ways you can approach this. You can just stay light, keep the rest period very, very short. You can try to go a little bit heavier, keep the rest periods a little bit longer. Um, there's really no right or wrong way. Basically, whatever you have access to, that'll dictate um, how you approach the workout. So I'll go over the movements real quick. Uh, doesn't need to be done barefoot, just my thing lately. The uh, strict press, so you'll start with that. Take the bar, get it up to your shoulders. Feet are under the hips, lock the legs, uh, elbows out in front, press the bar overhead to full lockout, lower it back down under control to the shoulders. Uh, so you're gonna do five of those, followed by seven front squats. So for the front squat, rack the bar. Now loosen the grip, get the elbows up nice and high, take your squat stance, sit all the way down to the bottom of the squat, stand all the way back up. You'll do seven of those. I'm just gonna do three. Uh, after that, the hang muscle clean. So you're gonna bring the barbell back down to the hips. Uh, I would recommend actually not using the hook grip for this, just to work the grip strength a little bit more. Uh, it's just gonna be a little bit of a dip of the knees, and then snap the hips, and bring the bar up to the shoulders. So you don't need to get a full rack position of the bar. If you end up going relatively heavy and you wanna do that, you can. Uh, but really the idea is just utilize a little bit of momentum and hip drive to pop the bar up get it up to the shoulders and lower it back down. So you're really using a little bit more of your arm than you normally would in a traditional clean and not dropping back underneath it. And then right into the deadlift. So after your ninth hang muscle clean, bring it down to your hips, lower down, tap the bar to the floor if there's plates on it. If not, just get it down below the knee and stand all the way back up. You'll do 11 of those, put the bar on the ground, rest as needed, and do it again uh, nine more times. And like I mentioned, the goal would be to do it with as little rest period as possible between each set, remain unbroken throughout the entire complex for all 10 rounds, and try to build up in weight if you have access to some plates. All right guys, enjoy, reach out with any questions.